In this video, we'll be showing how to restore a toolkit backup job on Windows. To simulate an issue that would require a restore job, I've deleted one of the backup job's source folders. After connecting the drive, open toolkit by clicking its icon in the taskbar. If toolkit isn't running at the moment, search for it in the start menu and click it to start it up. Verify you're in Toolkit's main menu by checking if there's a left-facing arrow in the top left corner. If there is an arrow there, click it. Here you can see which compatible drives are currently connected. Click Restore to get a restore job started. From the list, select which backup job needs to be restored. By default, the whole backup job will be restored. If you only wish to restore some files, they can be selected here. For example, I'm selecting the folder I deleted earlier. If the backup job has run multiple times, specific versions can be selected here on the right. Click Next to continue. Here, you can select where to restore the files to. By default, it will restore the files to the original location. Click Restore to begin the restore job. A progress bar pops up so the restore job can be monitored. Once completed, a message pops up to confirm. Check out our other videos for more information on how to use Toolkit on Windows. The description below also has some handy links that might be useful to you. Thank you for your time and for being a Seagate customer.